We are getting ever closer to the Elden Ring release date of February 25th, and as such, the developer From Software is starting to talk more about the title to aid the marketing push. It seems that the producer, Yasuhiro Kitao, has revealed how long the game will take to finish, though it's only if you mainline the story and ignore most of the side content. Speaking at Taipei Game Show 2022, Kitao said the idea is that the main route should be able to be completed within around 30 hours, though he also confirmed this will differ significantly from player to player. This isn't a huge shock and it's somewhere around the average of a game designed by From Software. Bloodborne is around 30 hours if you mainline it, while the Dark Souls series is generally a bit above that average aside Dark Souls 3, and Sekiro's Shadows Die Twice is on the shorter side at an average of 29 hours. Elden Ring, though, is seemingly the most ambitious and open-world game that From Software has created, and even from the closed network test, people discovered lots of optional content in just the starting area of the game. There were multiple bosses you could completely miss or avoid, so fans worrying about being shortchanged here probably shouldn't be too concerned. Kitao noted that these additional dungeons and bosses don't need to be explored to clear the game, but he does expect players will have many hours of fun exploring them. He also revealed that while the team hasn't measured the game world in terms of actual size, it is significantly larger than anything that's come before it from the studio. The game has now gone gold, which means it's been sent to manufacturers for disc-based versions to be made, which is a short roundabout way of saying that it won't be delayed now and it will definitely make that February 25th release date. For more on Elden Ring and for what's new and what's next, head to nme.com.